started doing graffiti when I was about 11, 12, around that time. My graffiti name is Guess. Um, the reason why I write Guess is for my friend that passed away, and I do it to keep his name alive. Yeah, uh, yeah, I do consider myself an artist because graffiti is an art, even though a lot of people don't look at it that way, but it is because it's a form of self-expression. My graffiti name is Scenic. I want them to see the, like, the time it takes to do it and the risk involved. Illegally? Yes. <laughs> yes, I do <laughs> graffiti illegally. That's the one that's going to put us in prison right there. <laughs> that's the Cause it's been a part of my life for so long and it's honestly like a drug it's something you just can't shake it's always there no matter what you're doing and honestly it's just something that I can never get rid of you have to be there personally to see the rush and the adrenaline and like the feeling you get when you're out there by yourself or with your friends Yes, I have. I've been arrested for graffiti twice. Uh, they treated me like shit. Um, they were threatening to break my hands. I was 13 when I got arrested. Sometimes I do feel guilty, but a lot of the times it's just like, fuck it. Yeah, graffiti can be vandalism and art. It just depends on where it's done. making art uh, no we're not a gang but I guess in the eyes of the law we are considered a gang yeah they do uh, crews always get into fights it's called beef graffiti's changed my life in a lot of ways like it brought me the friends that I have today and these are the friends that I've been with since I was younger and we all do it together and honestly it teaches you how to take risks and not be scared and just to say you know go for it like risk take risk. well that's the last of the train